Hello, everyone. Today I am going to show how to use DAQ Navy Assistant to write a level program for AI application. Right click the function block and you can find the DAQ Navy Assistant Express BI. Put it on the function block and a pop up window will appear. Select the analog input function. Click the next button. Select instant AI scenario. All available have will be displayed. Choose the demo device. Then you can configure input ranges and the grounding. Select which channels are used. After all, you can see all the configurations here. Now, move to the front panel. Drag one waveform chart to show acquired analog data. Put a stop button on the front panel. Put an arrow cluster on the front panel to check if there is any arrow. Except the waveform chart, we also want to see raw data by creating a numeric indicator array. Created. Let's go back to the function block to continue our programming. Connect the start button and the arrow cluster to the DAQ Navy Assistant. The DAQ Navy Assistant output is a DTT type data. It can be connected directly to the waveform chart. Using from DDTVI to transfer data, we can connect the data output to the numeric array. So, we use a while loop to enclose the program. Then, all the program inside the while loop will be run continuously. And when the, the while loop will stop running, uh, we use a, a bundle VI to get error status from DAQ Navy Assistant. Then, we can define the control loop will stop if any error happens or the stop button is pressed. So we use the OR function here to define that the while loop will stop if anyone presses the stop button or any error happens. Use a weight VI to control the while loop execution speed. Here, we want to define the while loop will be executed every 100 milliseconds. Okay, so the program is finished. Now we can successfully run the program now. Data from select channels is displayed. Thanks for watching. If you have any question, please contact Advantech.